So what if I told you that potentially Apple could be changing some things and removing a specific feature that I never thought Apple was going to go ahead and touch? So ever since pretty much the first iPhone, the exterior of our iPhone has completely changed, but there's always been kind of the same amount of buttons. We've always had the side button or the power button. We've always had the volume buttons, but we've always had this mute switch that's on the, in the side of our specific iPhone. So these mute switches have been here since pretty much the first couple of iPhones. I mean, I even think the first iPhone has had it. We've seen a lot of Android phones come and go and bring this feature and then remove it. But iPhones have always stayed consistent. Personally, for me, I never mess with my mute switch. I pretty much always have it down. This is my personal iPhone right here. And you can even see for mine, it's always down. It's always on silent. So there's some rumors coming around now that Apple is going to go ahead and basically remove this, but not remove the button, but completely change it for the most part. So this article is coming from Mac Rumors, and they basically state that the iPhone 15 Pro leak reveals united or unified volume button and mute button. So they go on to state that, you know, as previously rumored, the next generation of buttons are going to be bringing solid state buttons. So this means that these buttons are not going to actually click in. So you know how when you click up and down, these buttons are fully clicking in like they're actual mechanical buttons. Well, what's probably going to end up happening is that these buttons are now going to be solid state. So they're not going to be buttons that actually click in. They're going to be buttons that just, you know, have haptic feedback or vibrate as you go ahead and click them in. But also these are going to be unified. So these are not going to go ahead and be separate buttons like they are on the iPhone 14. They are going to be one button like they're kind of showcased here. But they also kind of mention about the mute button or the mute switch. So this is a kind of a leak or like a render of what could potentially be seen. So that is the mute button. So you can see that this is actually different than the mute switch that we have right now. So if we look at the mute switch, this thing clicks up and down. So you can click it up and you can click it down. Now Apple wants to go ahead and remove that and they want to go ahead and actually add a mute button, which I think actually makes probably more sense. So instead of clicking this thing down and then up, just like how we can do it here, well, now we'll just have to click this button. When we click it, it's going to go ahead and give us that little type of like, you know, pop-up it gave us before, and then it'll be on mute or it'll be on vibrate, whatever you know thing you're trying to set it up to. So that is something that is very interesting. And I do think this is probably going to make the most amount of sense for Apple to do. I think it's going to make a lot more sense for them to go down this direction. This article further states a couple other things here and there. But what does that mean for the iPhone 15s? Well, I think Apple could end up doing something similar to the iPhone 15, maybe not at the same caliber, or maybe they'll keep it the same way that the iPhone 14 is right now. But if you're getting one of the Pro models, you're getting the iPhone 15 Pro or the 15 Pro Max, well, chances are you were going to be experiencing one of those new types of buttons, and hopefully you like it because that's probably how Apple's going to end up doing it for the rest of the time now. So in terms of that, that kind of covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.